candidates for Iowa's 3rd Congressional District seat, Democrat Stacey Apple and Republican David Young, faced off Monday night in a debate hosted by KCCI and the Des Moines Register. Today, many political analysts are calling the debate a toss-up. Shana Humphreys has the highlights. Well, the candidates touched on everything from the retirement age to minimum wage to whether or not the government should enforce marijuana laws. But they started off defending themselves from attack ads. Maybe I know it wasn't clear enough in, at the last debate. But once again, let me say, I do not support terrorists having passports. I'm a sixth generation Iowan, proud to live in Dallas County and plan on living there the rest of my life. After clearing the attack ad air, the conversation moved to the aging population. The candidates were asked how they would deal with Social Security running out. Neither supported raising the retirement age or taxes, but Apple said she supports reforming drug prices, while Young supports means testing. Perhaps having the wealthy pay a little bit more. Apple wants to pay a little more in the way of minimum wage. She says that should be $10.10 an hour. One of the very first bills that I voted on was to increase the minimum wage to $7.25 an hour. That was a long time ago, seven years ago. Those folks are about time for a raise. Young said he would support the increase in minimum wage if it came along with tax relief for businesses. The candidates did not see eye to eye on hot button issues like immigration, foreign policy, and gun control. Apple supports things like universal background checks. Young acknowledged gun violence but wants no change in gun laws. Uh, for the most part, those those happen with people who have mental issues and we need to make sure that we increase our mental services and that we keep hands out of those who have these issues. In one of their few moments of agreement, both candidates said there needs to be a law protecting legal users of medical cannabis oil, but neither supports legalizing marijuana. They ended the debate back at odds, but on a lighter note. Got to be the Cubs. <laughs> now, our political analyst Dennis Goldford said this was a pretty tame debate, but he gave the slight edge to Stacey Apple, saying that her performance was much stronger compared to the first debate. Back to you.